Greetings from the eerie coast. This is Mad Shad. Thor Vigi. May Thor bless. Aha. Well, it is currently 20, 29, 29 degrees here in Cleveland. Uh, we had some ice and snow this uh, last night uh, and woke up to a it's it's all kind of melting away a little bit here and there, yeah, whatever. Uh, and then tomorrow is going to be nice uh, in the 40s, they say. So there's that. Uh, once again, I am here to tell you, there are still Americans trapped in Afghanistan. And it is a humanitarian crisis going on over there. Famine is <laughs> has, has gripped the country. Uh, but... Famine has gripped the country. The Taliban is freaking out, going home to home and, you know, getting food wherever they can, you know, uh, while, while trying to maintain their sense of dominance over the country. Uh, but so within that, within that, uh, that chaos, uh, folks are getting out. They are actually taking advantage and getting out. Um, so... Oh, it's snowing. All right, great. A little lake effect snow here. But there's hope. Like I said, there's hope. There are people getting them out. Uh, Project Exodus, Project Dynamo, Task Force Argo, Task Force Pineapple, uh, our Christian coalition, uh, they are getting these folks out. Um, at least we forget 13 servicemen and women of this great nation's military died at Abbey Gate in August. During this, this retreat by Trader Joe and his malicious and or incompetent regime. <laughs> Meanwhile in the news, Ukraine, Russia, Russia, Ukraine, Ukraine, Russia, Russia, Ukraine, Ukraine, Russia, whatever. Anyway, you know the deal. Uh, <laughs> look over here while we do this. Oh, gas prices are going up. Food is going up. Everything's going up. <laughs> it's all by design, people. Uh, you know, we're sitting on the largest uh, oil deposits in the world, untapped resources. All we got to do is just drill a little bit. That's it. Uh, meanwhile, I heard that 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 Biden uh, Bender has uh, has opened up oh 60 million gallon or 60 million gallons of oil, of, of oil. Oh great, thanks. That's enough for three days here in the United States of America. We yes, we we go through 60 million gallons of, of gasoline in three days. Yeah, that's that's ah. Anyway, uh, <laughs> I heard something uh, interesting. Uh, I don't know how true this is or how, how this is going to play out, but I found it interesting uh, that Mr. T, uh, I'm sorry, the Honorable uh, Pro POTUS Mr. T uh, has, uh, <laughs> there's a rumor that he's going to run for Speaker of the House and then impeach. Biden and Harris become acting president and then win the presidency in 2024 and be the only, I don't know, I don't know, I'm going to have to check on that one. Uh, any of you uh, presidential uh, historians out there, I'm going to have to look into that. Uh, apparently, that so he would be the only president to serve three terms. Uh, I don't think that's right. I, th I think there was another one uh, in later... Uh, earlier on in our history. I'm not sure about that, but, uh, so <laughs> that is interesting. But I'm still kind of wrapping my mind, wrapping my head around how this would work, how it would play out. I, I don't know. Uh, I, I do find it interesting indeed. Uh, but so <laughs> there's always hope, right? There's always hope. Uh, <laughs> So, anyway, this has been Mad Shad. Every day, never forget.